cross-section of top government officials, civil society groups, religious leaders and other dignitaries converged on the new festival hall of government house to be storm on ways to assist the poor, protect the plight of the vulnerable in the society and also deliver effectively on the fight against gender-based violence in the state. Expressing her worries over the delay in the case of late Vera Uwaila, Mrs. Betsy Obaseki said, despite the fact that the death of the undergraduate led to the national campaign on the fight against gender-based violence, our killers are yet to be arrested and brought to justice. I particularly am sad to note that the killers of Uwaila, those who brutally murdered and killed that young child, are still at large and are still not be brought to book. And we are using this opportunity to call on the interested government and all of the agencies involved, the police, civil defense, and all of the relevant bodies to please step up the work and ensure that Wyla's killers are caught and prosecuted. In solidarity with the State Committee on Gender-Based Violence, the Edo State Governor, Mr. Gordon Obaseki, said the security agencies must ensure the culprits are arrested and prosecuted. Two years after Wala was brutally murdered in the city, we have still not been able to prosecute the perpetrators. The Inspector General of Police insisted that this case should be moved to headquarters, which was done. As we speak, investigations are stalling. The investigation teams keep asking for money to do their work. This is really, really sad. And we will not be able to make progress in our fight against gender-based violence, except we get the support from the very highest authorities in Nigeria. I am shocked that with the interest which the president has shown in gender-based violence crimes, that the police has not been able to use this very, very sad incident which shook the whole world as a, an example to show that it has the capacity to deal with this sort of violent crimes in our society. Governor Baseki thereafter launched the Gender-Based Violence Training Manual prepared by the Edo State Tax Force on Gender-Based Violence. Patience, Osao Giwa, reporting.